James, honey, did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? for you, James. See? I'm real. Alright, what's up everyone? Happy Sunday. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's having a good weekend. Last time, we was, um, Gonna get a cutscene here. But yeah, last time we just finished the hospital. Mario got impaled. <laughs> Maria's dead. I couldn't protect her. Once again, I couldn't do anything to help her. Laura has run off somewhere. Mary, what what should I do? Are you really waiting somewhere for me? Or is this your way of taking... Hmm. I'm gonna find Mar Mary. It's the only thing I have left to hope for. I believe it's this way I'm going, right? Yes. 
We're gonna go all the way to Rendell and then to South Street, I believe. We don't have to fight these guys, we can just want to pass them. Okay, keep going. Go down here. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Just as long as you keep moving, you'll be fine. That was unlock. Yes. And we're now in South Street, right? Yeah, okay. I think I missed that. Alright, so they want me to go to Millie's and get the wrench. For the record, you don't have to go there. Um, I just like going there, but you don't really need to go there. If you really want to see Mary, you should just die. But you might be heading to a different place than Mary, James. I don't have a map of this area. What do you mean? Whatever. Whatever game. <laughs> Off to Lindsay Street. Shh. 
shit, I almost walked into that. Oh, so there's a drink right there. Lindsay Street, perfect. And the house will be, oh, there it is. Usually you get the camera angle. I got a wrench. There's also something here. Or perhaps you have, or a fool. The truth usually betrays people. A part of the abyss is the whole society. The key is to, to this society is in the park. Yes, I, I know what it is. Gotta go over to the park. And basically, just have to go to the statue in the park. Um, Should be this way, right? Yeah, we're good. Yeah, I just want to check something on Jack's end, that's all, before I go to the park. Maybe I didn't say, like, maybe I didn't load a, a new game plus or whatever. But yeah, there should have been, like, a uh, doghouse here. I'm not sure why it's not here, though. Anyways, let me go back to the park. I just passed it. But yeah, it should have been here. The doghouse should have been here. Now I have to find that statue. Maybe 
here? I'm not I don't think it's here. This is it's usually a grassy area. Yeah, it's not here. Oh, there it is. That's the satch. Yes, we will dig it.
By the way, I don't know if you guys noticed, but um, if you look at the overlay I put, that's the same as that um, scenery that that you're looking at right now. <laughs> Anyways, let me just drop down. Killing a person ain't no big deal. Just put the gun to their head. Pow. You, you killed him? But, but, but it wasn't my fault. He, he made me do it. Calm down, Eddie. Tell me what happened. That guy, he, he had it coming. I didn't do anything. He just came after me. Besides, he was making fun of me with his eyes, like that other one. Just for that, you killed him? What do you mean, just for that? Eddie, you can't just kill someone because of the way they looked at you. Oh yeah? Why not? Till now, I always let people walk all over me. Just like that stupid dog. He had it coming too. Eddie? <laughs> I was just joking, James. He was dead when I got here, honest. Anyway, I gotta run. You're going out there alone? Yeah. Eddie? Thank you. 
Down. Is there one behind me? Oh shit, it is behind me. Heal up. I should also reload. Pick this up. Reload. Hey, zombie. 
Happy Sunday. Oh shit. I think I'm supposed to go to the... I know there's a room. It's... It's that three room... That three room... Um, room. Sorry, that three door room. That's what I meant to say. I know there's going to be like a patient demon there too. Wait for it. I think that's everything there, right? <laughs> I think that's everything. Uh, let me just make sure. Ah. Can I go here? Yeah. Ah, yes, that's the important thing. Get the rifle. Almost done with the prison. All right. So with this part right here, we're gonna combine some elements. We're gonna combine this. Combine this, and combine this. Done. All right, the next part will be the labyrinth. This part is going to... Oh, whatever. Right, this is the morgue, you'll see like corpses and stuff. Did that just move or was it my only my imagination? More holes to drop down on. Yeah, I know that this part is gonna be the labyrinth. Ugh, I don't like this part. It's not bad, it's just tiring. Because you have to guess your way through. Yeah, about to drop down again. Down the hole. Well, now this time it's going to be an elevator. Yeah, I think we're almost done, though, with the game. It's going to be... Um, it's going to be this part. The the maze. Then we... Um, I think we're going to meet Eddie after this. No, 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 no. We have the, the abstract daddy the boss. Then... Yeah, I think then we meet up with Eddie, and then after that we gotta go to the hotel. I think that's pretty much it. A zombie. Hope all is well. Yeah, it looks like we're pretty much done. Um, well, I'm, I'm making it seem like I'm almost done with the game, but no, I still have to get to the, the hotel. The hotel is going to be kind of draining as well. 
So there's two major parts left. Right. I don't think I need a save. Uh, I don't think I would die here. I'll be fine. This is just a maze. I have to kill these two. I know there's going to be two patient demons here. I know there's going to be another one around. Let me just uh, reload. Oh, right on time. And the whole sake of this is just making my map. Because I need to recognize where I'm going. I don't think I need to go here. Because I know what's going to what's gonna take me down here. That's where pyramid. This is an optional area, so I don't. I don't need to go here. Pyramid head is gonna be down there. Um, yeah, you. you I don't need to go there. <laughs> All right, where am I now in the map? Because I believe there's gonna be um. I think I should be fine here. Yeah, yeah. I would definitely be fine there. I believe the next path is going to be linear or going down, so I should be fine. I don't have to worry about any fork in the roads. The memory serves me right. Yeah, I'm just wasting bullets now. I don't even care. Um, cause I, for like the major things in the, in this game, I don't use my handgun. I use other types of ammo. Alright, let me just go back up. Yes, we're almost at the end, zombie. I can't solve this puzzle yet. So I'm probably going to come back here later. Because this one is a puzzle here. Uh, I can't solve that yet. However, we could change the rooms, I think. Hold on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Because I remember this. This is the weird puzzle head thing. Am I facing wrong the way? I probably am. There we go. Um, let's see. Nope. No walls behind me. No doors behind me. Okay, I got a door. But it leads to nothing. <laughs> A door, but no, nope, nope, nope. Okay, we got a door. Nope. Just gotta play with the puzzle. That's all. Um. There's no exit there. No, no exit.
There we go. Got it. Protagonist. Now we still have to head back because it's not done with the the the, the maze. You're alive, Maria. I thought that thing killed you. Are you hurt bad? Not at all, silly. Maria? That thing, it stabbed you. There was blood everywhere. Stabbed me? What do you mean? It chased us to the elevator, and James, then- James, what are you talking about? Just before. Don't you remember? James, honey, did something happen to you? After we got separated in that long hallway? Are you confusing me with someone else? <laughs> you were always so forgetful. Remember that time in the hotel? Maria? You said you took everything, but you forgot that videotape we made. I wonder if it's still there. How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? I'm not your Mary. So, you're Maria? I am. If you want me to be. All I want from you is an answer. It doesn't matter who I am. I'm here for you, James. See? I'm real. Don't you want to touch me? I... don't know. Come and get me. I can't do anything through these bars. Okay. Stay right there. I'll be there soon.
Cause I think this one has multiple paths. Um, cause I'm trying to think. Well, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I think this is the one with the the multiple paths. I could be wrong. I was being cocky, but like, ah, I don't want to reload. <laughs> Pick up the bullet. Oh, shit. <laughs> Pick up the bullets, James. Make sure I reload. Okay, I already did. Never mind. I hope I went the right way. <laughs> ah, okay, we are. Let me make sure I save. We're gonna get a boss fight. That should be before I save. Let me equip my my shotgun. Go ahead and save. Because we're gonna get a boss fight. There's a newspaper on the ground. And this basically tells you like a little backstory of Angela and her father. Uh, you can't really read much of it. But later identified as Thomas Orozco Lumberjack, age 39, was discovered in the something from Lane Farm. Uh, the probable cause of death has multiple stab wounds to the front of the neck and the left side of the torso by a sharp edged weapon. The estimated date of the death was somewhere between 11 p.m. and 12.30 midnight. I saw my favorite draw, drew uh, Felicia. I like it a lot. I think he's drawing her again, be, probably the last one, because he said he has more Felicia in his mind until he draws someone else. Okay, that's good. Due to signs of a struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon, police are considering this is a homicide and have opened a murder investigation. Furthermore, given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and Mr. Orozco had a history of drunkenness and violence, the police... Uh, detected that I can't read that part it was not robbery or crime but this is basically a little backstory about Angela's dad I didn't mean to do that I was trying to get to the door there we go and then we're gonna hear a scream Right. 
your favorite artist. I understand what you meant. Favorite true artist. <laughs> your favorite artist, I understand. Kind of funny every October I see more Dark Circles. Not that I'm complaining, but I find it funny it has to be that month. Yeah, I agree. No, 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 don't let him grab me! Okay, got it. Okay. Yep. All right. I know the next area I gotta solve a, Angela, a room puzzle. Relax. Don't order me around. I'm it's uh the hangman puzzle or something like that. I just have to read the. The papers, but it kind of gives away who's the innocent man. When I get there, I'll explain it. This boss is weird. Yeah, it's called the Abstract Daddy. Um, and it's a very obvious reason why it's called that. So what? What it? Why it looks weird? That's why it's called that. It's it's like two, you see like two corpses on top of each other. Yeah, you, you get the idea. <laughs> Angela, don't touch me. So it's very suggested that um Angela was, you know, she had some daddy issues. And I don't know if you know this zombie, but um every character that James meet is a rep representation of either James or um Mary. Right. Yes, she was ill. Now it's kind of hard to tell if these are real people, or these are like figments of uh, James' imagination. It's kind of hard to tell because everyone has a calling in Silent Hill. So I don't know if I I kind of want to I I kind of want to say it is real people, but it's kind of hard to tell. It might. No, no, you're you're absolutely right. That's exactly what it is, zombie. Um, no, no, it is, it's, no, I think, it is. <laughs> Alright, let me, uh, I don't think I need the shotgun now, but just in case. I think I just have to solve, no, no, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come across some mannequins. James is weird. Because I believe, no, I believe I have to solve a puzzle, if I get it wrong, I will, um, be attacked by some um I will be attacked by some mannequins if I get it wrong. Now I just have to So because the riddles is on normal, I already know what the answer is. I have to look for the arsonist, I believe. Now the thing is that the answers are different depending on your difficulties, but it basically you have to find the innocent man. Uh no, it's not that. But the answers are different. I think um, the easy mode the can, is the kidnapper and uh, the hard mode. I think it's the counterfeiter. But in our case, we're looking for the arsonist. Well, I couldn't read it. Whatever. <laughs> you have to like face their faces. For arson. So, okay, it's this one. That's going to be our innocent person. Just as long as I answer it right, I should be fine. Um, it will be this door, I believe. So, what you have to do is release the hand. The hand, run on. We yeah, just so I'll pull it, and that's our innocent person right there.
Now, if I got it right, there will be no enemies, and uh, that person will be set free. We'll we'll see. I don't see no enemies, so we're in the we're on to a good start. Ah, yes, we got it right. Okay. I got the keys of the persecute, and that will set us free. Wait, I don't know if you saw that. I just saw the inside of the wall when I came into the room. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Um. Anyways, we can open this door. And look at here. And use those keys that we just got. All right, we're now gonna confront Eddie. So now I could get my Oh yeah, I just remember the spooky music that's gonna be playing. Whatever. I don't need a shotgun yet, but I'm just gonna equip it. I don't need to go there yet. Um, we go to this room and we're going to see Maria. Maria? Maria? Maria, no. What happened to you? I remember one time I was playing this like late at night, like around midnight or one o'clock at night. And uh, I don't know why, I've seen this scene so many times, but it was one time late at night, that music was just, it just hit me the wrong way. And seeing this like, I'm like, oh, this is gonna make me sleep really weird. I don't know why. It just, that one night it just hit me wrong. Oh, also, hi. You like this puzzle? <laughs> Alrighty, let's make our way out of here. It's so symbolic. Yeah. So, for... So, I, I do kind of... I do find I kind of like this part right here so you're like in a unknown cemetery around here and um well I'll talk about this later let me just pick up these items first oh, I can't get through here first um let me just pick up these items but a lot of these are like foreshadowing uh, I'm not gonna save yet but these on these um these dug, dug up graves right here I'll get get into that I get you. It's not hidden right now either. It's like, yeah, yeah, I agree. It's like at that one moment, it's like, it, it just gets me really good. Hey, name, how are you doing? Happy Sunday. So, um, let's talk about these tombstones. It's too scratched up to read, so we can't read that one. Um, because I know there's like an Easter egg for one of the characters in Silent Hill 4. The name inscribed, there's a name inscribed on the tombstone, Walter Sullivan. We're gonna hear about that in Silent Hill 4, and for those who don't know, that's that's actually my favorite Silent Hill. <laughs> so yeah, that's an easter egg from Silent Hill 4, Silent Hill 4. Uh, I don't know what the order, I'm probably going wrong. So yeah, so um, the name on this tombstone is Eddie. Dombrowski, the, 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 the I probably, 
sorry for the stuttering, Dabrowski. The name inscribed on this tombstone is Angela Roscoe. And um, this one right here. The name here is for James Sunderland. What? <laughs> so anyways, we're supposed to chip down on our grave. <laughs> oh, I didn't save, but whatever. Whatever. I think I, I could beat this. I should be fine. I remember one time I was playing this on, I think it was hard. And I was trying to go for the 10 star rating. And this is where I actually legit rage quit. Because for you to get the 10 stars, you have to save at the most two times. And I I underestimated, I really underestimated Eddie. And he got me so good that um, I had to restart to my last checkpoint. I don't remember where I saved, but it was very far. I think it was at the, no, I do know, I do remember where I saved. The last save was at the, it's the save right before you and Maria have to run out of the elevator uh, in the hospital. And I was so pissed off. I was like, I'm never going to do the hard, the the hard speed, well, not speed run, but the hard um challenge. So, yeah. <laughs> of the Hawaiian princess there. Yes. <laughs> I should be fine with uh, this boss fight. I should be fine. Eddie, but yeah, the what are you doing? the labyrinth what or the maze, whatever like? you want to call it, that that one really um, it drains you. It's not it's not as bad as I'm making it out to be, but it drains you a lot. That's why I, I didn't want to just continue streaming last night. When I finish the hospital, like I want to save that for tomorrow, and then not to mention that I have to go to the hotel after this. Doing the hotel it could be also a <laughs> frustrating moment because there's a part in the game where you ha you're gonna be on arm, and you just have to run for your life. He didn't like that. I knew it. He did you not like too. that. You're just like him, James. And there's not really no strategy for this. You just shoot, that. shoot and run. Because there's not no place you have cover in this room. Well, as far as this part, um, I know when um when you go into the next room, all you have to do is um. Like, really, there's no strategy. <laughs> there's, like, no strategy at all. Alright, okay, it's already reloaded. The details in the game never fail. So yeah, I agree. I really like those CG cutscenes. They're so good for a PS2 game. It's really good. He should be shot down already. Oh, I skipped the cutscene. <laughs> My gosh. Cause I, was, I was pressing start so fast. The on all part of the hotel is so off. Yeah, I agree. I definitely agree. Just being help. I mean, even though you're on arm, it's not that bad. Especially if you know. I mean, if you know what you're what you're supposed to do, it's not as bad as as it looks. But it is unnerving. I agree. All right, time for the real battle. But yeah, for those who didn't see the, the cutscene I skipped, Eddie basically just runs away because he got shot.
That's why I ran away after I killed the dog. Ran away like a scared little <laughs> girl. Yeah, I killed that dog. It was fun. It tried to chew its own guts up. Finally died all curled up in a ball. Then he came after me. I shot him too, right in the leg. He cried more than the dog. <laughs> Gonna have a hard time playing football on what's left of that knee. You think it's okay to kill people? You need help, Eddie. <laughs> he needs help, sure. Don't get a holy on me, James. This town called you too. Yeah. You and me are the same. We're not like other people. Don't you know that? The only downside about the shotgun, it leaves you kind of wide open. And Eddie has that really fast gun. Oh shit, punch! I forgot those punches do a lot of damage. Alright, All right, I'm, I'm just fucking around right now. Reload. Heal, 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 heal. Ooh, that's doing a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah. I know, like, when you do a lot of damage on him, he starts running. Oh, he's reloading. He's reloading. Fucking sex in the way. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's gonna punch me. You know, now that I, I think about it, I think that's what killed me when I played it on hard, hard mode. He just fucking punched me. I'm like, really? Where is he? Fucking sucker punch me. Don't die now. Don't die, James. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> I'll heal after the, the, the cutscene. Eddie? Eddie? I... I killed a... a human being. A human being. Mary. Did you really die three years ago? Yeah. That's where the real plot is right there. Did you really die? Three years ago. Oh yeah, I better heal. Eh, it's not that bad. I don't think I'm going to need a shotgun. So let me get back to my handgun. I believe this should be a save. Oh no, it's not. Uh, I might be thinking about the the for the UFO end, and there's like a spot here. Oh, there is a save here. Okay. Uh, yes, I'm just I'm just getting more memories about um <laughs> the AC collection that has no water. 
All right, time to hop on the boat. And the whole trick right here with the boat, as far as easy and, and normal mode, you just have to like aim your sticks into the... Oh yeah, this also affects kind of your ending as well, how long you stay in the water. Um, yeah, now I forgot that's the condition here. It also is a condition for your your star ranking. How high your, your score is going to be. But yeah, the whole trick is like if you're playing on easy or normal mode, it's just um, move your thumbstick to like a certain angle and you'll be okay. I believe in hard mode, you have to rotate the thumbsticks um, like you're rowing the actual boat. Alright, so we just have to look for the, f the, the searchlight. Once we find the searchlight, we should be okay. There it is, I found the searchlight. Now we are a-okay. Yeah, the lesser you, you, you and but like I said before, I'm going to any percent right now, so. So I don't know what ending I'm going to end up with, but um, he says he got that fast reload with the revolver. Wonder where he, yeah, I know, right? That part seems kind of, yeah, the, well, the whole, the whole fight with him is kind of weird because uh, he's like punching you and then he has the, the revolver. Yeah, okay. That didn't take that long. All right, I believe there's a mermaid box, music box, right before I enter the, the hotel. So I'll make sure to go grab that before I continue. Paddle, paddle, yes. <laughs> And I don't know. I don't want to give the, the the image that I'm a pro with Silent Hill 2, but I play this game a lot. I'm not trying to sound cocky, but I play this game a lot. <laughs> I really did. This place hasn't changed at all in three years. Yeah, there should be like a music box here. No, yeah, yeah, it is in the fountain. I remember this because the the um, the the camera angle changes. Like, oh, 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 there it is. There it goes. It, it does like a real up close um camera angle. I really like that camera angle, by the way. But then I should be able. To, wait, wrong way. <laughs> I should be able to go get a a map once I'm stepping inside to the hotel. Once I find the door, am I? There we go. <laughs> There should be a map here. You know, I think the only enemies I'll find are those abstract daddies on um, bosses. Not bosses. Now they're common enemies now. So, ream, room, room 312 is where she's waiting for me. Got it. Of course, that'll be more easier said than done. Alright. These are the, the guest room map. But first, let's go see. Um, I know I'm supposed to meet up with Laura somewhere. I know she's going to be here somewhere. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Maybe I should use my map. <laughs> I think it's, yeah, in the restaurant Lakeshore. There we go. And then we're going to get like a fake jump scare around here. <laughs> I think there's a key here. Oh, <laughs> I love James' uh, expression right here. He's just like, oh, bug off. He just waves his hand. There he goes. <laughs> Did, I Did I scare you? Yeah, you <laughs> did. You're here to find Mary, aren't you, James? Well, have you? No. Is that why you're here too? 
She's here, isn't she? If you know where she is, tell me. I'm tired of walking. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. What letter? I'm gonna read it. But don't tell Rachel, okay? Who's Rachel? She was our nurse. I took it from her locker. Okay, there it goes. My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now, in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James, I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true he may be a little surly sometimes, but he doesn't laugh much. But underneath, he's really a sweet person. Laura, I love you like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th birthday. And yeah, that's a giveaway right there. Your friend forever, Mary. The age right there. Laura, how old are you? Um, I turned 8 last week. So... Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. That's why I'm here. Maybe you'll get it if you see the other letter. The one, Mary. Huh? I must have dropped it. Laura. I gotta find it. Laura. You feel the same way about yeah. This is a good game though. I, I I understand why people say this is like their favorite. Where's that strike daddy yet? Oh shit! <laughs> no! No! I think there's a second one right here. There should be a second one. Yeah, there he is. I know there's like a room with, um, let me choose my guns, with the mannequins. They're just gonna be hanging there, like in the hallway. Gotta remember which one it is. I think it's the. Oh shit! Jinxed it! Just jinxed it. <laughs> Everything here. I feel like there should have been more stuff there, no? No, I guess there wasn't. No, oh, well. I don't know. I could have swore there was like more stuff there. Let's not go there yet. Let's go here. 
here. Wait, I didn't go. I didn't get the whatchamacallit. I forgot to reload. Oh shit! <laughs> I don't think I yeah, I, I don't think I can go there yet. Okay, it's not it's not in vain, because I I needed that thinner anyways. Right, let's go up. Oh my, I'm dropping frames, that's not good. <laughs> I'm just giving it a moment. Okay, we're good. We're back, we're back. Or not. I'm just waiting for OBS to relax right now. I'm not, I'm fluctuating with with the frames right now. Come on, OBS. <laughs> And just in case you can't hear me, I'll put in chat that I'm dropping frames. The window drawing, yeah. Those window drawings are quite random. We're almost at the end, too. Guys kept in the office on the first floor. Yes. Is that everything in there? I'm just checking the map. Um, I think that's everything.